20th anniversary is truly a wonderful milestone. After two years of the pandemic and to say, yes, we're here, we're having a public event, there are kids here, galleries are open, it's doubly a celebration. It's a wonderful honor to be included in this show. It's amazing for me to be exhibited in this museum, a place that I have loved forever. It is an intimate act to create a piece of art. You're sharing a part of your soul with people. And then to have the actual artwork on a wall in a museum gallery, it's like, well, this is like the the essence of my soul that I'm that I'm showing here. These are my most favorite colors, my most favorite pieces of paper, my most favorite textures and fabrics. Sharing the artwork in person really opens up so many avenues for learning about each other. The museum has far surpassed Eric and Bobby's initial dreams. We've seen almost a million visitors. Our exhibitions travel around the world. It's a lot of influence. We finally got back together again. And coming through the pandemic, we're figuring out how to be in the same space together. We're figuring out how to communicate and relax and really celebrate in a joyous, a momentous occasion of all these wonderful artists. I mean, that's major. And, and it hits me in a big way because it's all collage. And that's my thing. Collage is more than just assembling supplies and ideas and things together. It's, it, it's way bigger. It's, it's a metaphor for life. Everybody that walks through the door is broken in some place in their lives. And collage is about putting things together and becoming whole. I love this museum. I've never had my art shown in a gallery before. It's like breathing in fresh air. You're out in the world, and your work is out in the world. And because we're talking about collage, and collage is something you touch, you need to feel, and you need to piece together, and you need to use scissors and glue. Very tactile medium. And so I love that the whole museum feels like that. I think we saw more clearly than ever the sort of urgency of the work that we feel like we're doing here at the museum, the importance of picture books as a way for children to understand themselves and understand the world. And so many children need a lot of reassurance. All I want children to know is that Miss Vanessa loves you and I see you. Thank you so You're very so much. I see you with your missing tooth. I see you with that hair lick that you're trying to control or that big fluffy afro. I see you with your dark skin and wondering why you're not accepted in community that you're in. I, I want you to know I see you. I see hope in you. I see creativity in you. I see joy in you. I see the ability to be anybody and anything that you want to do. You can do it. You are perfect just the way you are. Eric really respected the aesthetic that children have. So the museum was in so many ways for Eric, I think, a place where children could come together and feel that what they have to contribute is important too. To know that there is this institution that has such a broad and rich collection of children's book work as a resource for all of us who are creators is fantastic and as a resource for families to come to is amazing. I 
always tell kids like every story is important, every story is valid, especially yours. 